100% of the attendees of that course won the Nobel Prize. No other course has that, you know? That course holds the world record for number of Nobel Prizes. <laughs> Chinese Nobel laureate and physicist Chen Ninyang dies at the age of 103. That BBC article mostly talks about his Nobel Prize, mm -hmm. which was given for discovering the theoretical foundations for something called parity violation. One of the cool things about his time at Chicago was he was actually in a two-person class with Sung Dao Lee under the tutelage of Subramaniam Chandrasekhar, mm -hmm. okay? Subramaniam Chandrasekhar is one of my heroes, personally, one of the heroes of Indian physics. He um, discovered the Chandrasekhar limit, which is the white dwarf limit, how big a star can get before it can no longer be a white dwarf. Mm -hmm. um, at the age of like 19 or 20, he discovered this. He faced intense racism in Great Britain um, by someone by the name of Arthur Eddington, who himself great physicist or whatever but you know whatever gatekeeper uh, we get it yeah we we get it so he he was hired by the university of chicago and at the time he was working at the yerkes observatory in wisconsin um he offered this course i forget what the course was actually but only two people signed up it was sung dao lee and yang chen lee yang cheng ning okay um he would drive 200 miles from yerkes observatory to chicago every week to um do this course and teach this course but good thing for him because that course holds the world record for number of Nobel Prizes. 100% of the attendees of that like course. Because he got two students, students and, and both, both won the Nobel Prize. That's so crazy. <laughs> that's actually pretty crazy. That's a great, like, like, that's a record that I don't think it's ever going to be beat.